Hi everyone, welcome back to UWorld's question of the day. My name is Samantha, I'm a nurse here at UWorld, and we're back with our final day of obstetrics week. So today the nurse is talking with a client who had an uncomplicated vaginal delivery one day ago, which of the following statements by the client would require follow-up. Read through the options, pause the video if you need to, and drop your answers into the comments below. I'm gonna jump into our rationale. So our correct option, option number one, that dull headaches for the next week. So persistent headache as well as blurred vision indicate postpartum preeclampsia signs. So the majority of clients with preeclampsia are gonna develop their symptoms before birth, but a small percentage does develop the complication after birth. This is a potentially serious condi condition. It can rapidly worsen. This can lead to seizures and even potentially death if left untreated. Option two, three, and four are all going to be correct statements. Therefore, they don't require follow-up. We do want to make sure we keep those leg exercises going while they're resting to prevent DVT due to that hypercoagulation state that the body's in following delivery. Option three, pinkish brown vaginal discharge should be expected for the next four to 10 days. This is describing lochia serosa. Um, right after birth, we have that lochia rubra, the bright red bleeding, but it transitions to that lighter pinker discharge four to 10 days after birth. Uh, this is correct. And lastly, option number four, that sadness and mood changes for longer than two weeks is indicative of postpartum depression. This client needs to go in and uh, seek help, notify their medical provider. So again, option number one is our correct option. Way to go, you guys. Click the link in bio for more information on UWorld Nursing.